Hi, it's Sarah from iHeartBuds.com. Today I'm showing you some of my favorite seed pods to use in terrariums, vivariums, and in isopod bins. Um, these are some of my favorite ones. I get asked a lot of questions about their texture and size and all that, so I figured a video would help. Um, these are lotus seed pods. I love these. I don't know if you can hear it. They're thin. Um, isopods love to hang around in them, hide, and they also just look cool in a terrarium. These are called bell cups. They're hard, um, kind of wood-like, and some people silicone the inside if they have dart frogs so that they can be used for egg deposition sites um, and it will retain the water. A lot of, some people also plant small plants in here and you can um, attach it to your background in your terrarium. These are called trumpet pods. They're very interesting. They're, they're, they're very, they almost feel rock-like, but um, they have a nice opening. Small frogs can um, use them as hides. Um, they look really cool just being in the terrarium and Isopods and springtails will also hang out in them. These are pear pods. They, um, I like to put them in my isopod, or I'm sorry, springtail master cultures. The springtails, I sit them on top of the soil and the springtails just crawl all over it. And so it's easy to pick one of these pear pods up and just kind of tap it off like like that and the springtails go everywhere. These also just look really cool on your terrarium floor. I've also got, I'm probably going to mispronounce this, they're called Pau Terra Estrella um, pods. These really just kind of look cool. Um, I have noticed that springtails like them as well and I have been putting them in my springtail master cultures, and I can use these two to tap off the springtails when I want to feed some to my dart frogs. Then we have the magnolia pod, which is very common. I tend to use these with my isopods in my isopod bins because they like to hide in there. Same thing with the springtails. It also, this looks really good in terrariums um, just because it has that texture so it makes you look towards it. Here we have some sweet gum pods. I like to use these in with my isopods also. Um, isopods and springtails, um, especially the babies, love to crawl in, in here and, and they do consume them as well. This is one of my favorite pods right here. It is called the Talami pod. It's big, it's, it's fibrous. Um, it, it just looks really cool, and microfauna, such as springtails and isopods, they do hide in it. It just looks really cool on your terrarium floor, and I highly recommend these. And then this is also one of my favorite pods. They're called urchin pods or bolsa pastor. Um, they're not, they feel like I could crush them in half. They're not super sturdy but they do hold up well. They have an interesting texture. Um, springtails and isopods do love hiding in them. Um, my dart frogs will also hide in them and I like small small geckos could also hide in them as well but they're it looks cool on your terrarium floor and it is an excellent hide. So those are my favorite pods seed pods and nut pods that I have. Um, they're all available on the website and if you have any questions just reach out and feel free to ask.